So we're here at the Soul Cafe on Fernie Way. Chris and the team have recently done a great renovation here. It's looking superb. Yeah, that's right. It's always buzzing. And of course, they do great coffee, great food. And so on and myself, we love seeing places like this thrive in the Hills District. Today is just a quick update on the local property market. Over the last quarter, there's been some mixed messaging from the media. This is largely based on what's happening down in the southern states. But if you're looking in Brisbane, in particular the Hills District, things are looking really positive for property owners. Here, buyer demand's high. We're just not seeing the impact of the pandemic like other states. And as a result, we're seeing prices remain steady. We're seeing multiple groups through open homes and we're getting really great results for our owners. In fact, lenders have reported a huge spike in pre-approvals for their lending. To back up these sentiments, here are some highlights. For Burley Crescent, Fernie Hills, Denise and Connor prepared their house and styled it perfectly for the market. We knew it was the house for a number of buyers we were working with. We didn't take this property to market. Instead, we invited our buyer database to a property preview. Out of the 22 buyers that attended the inspection, we received three offers with a successful offer accepted three days later, well above the vendor's expectations. 59 Minto Crescent, Arana Hills. We knew this property would receive a lot of interest, so we opened it up to a wider market online. After 47 inspections, two offers, and only nine days on the market, Minto Crescent was sold to a young first-home buyer couple. 18 Carinia Street, Fernie Hills. This family was selling their family home and wanted a smooth transaction. We suggested selling pre-market to our buyer database. We received a lot of interest from our interstate buyers. Two offers were made and a successful offer coming from a buyer's agent from a buyer down south. 7 Ballylin Street, Fernie Grove. Another property that went to market and received a lot of interest in its first week due to the proximity to the Fernie Grove train station. Melina was very happy to receive two offers on her property after the first inspection, signing a contract in nine days after launching to the market. There is no shortage of buyers interested in the hills. And if you're looking to make a move in the next six to 12 months, now is the time to capitalise on the low stock and the high buyer interest. That's right, it is the perfect time. And if you want to catch up for a chat, talk about your options and even the opportunity to market to our database, just give us a call. Well, that's it from us today. Make sure you come down, say good day to Chris, grab yourself a coffee or a bite to eat. We highly recommend the Brecky Burger. It is amazing.